guys, I posted a picture on Instagram and I did the hashtag Insta haul and I showed a bunch of clothes and craft supplies and food that I'm actually going to be using for crafts. And I said that, you know, I wasn't going to film the haul because I had already taken everything out of the bags and I had already been using things. But I decided that I do want to film the haul for you guys since so many of you showed interest in seeing the things up close and personal in a video. And you guys like when I do haul videos. And it's been a while since I've done a haul video on this channel. So now that I've just talked for about an hour, um, yeah, let's get into all the things that I bought. And this is stuff that I've bought over even the past month or even longer, some of it. Um, this is a collective haul. All right, let's go. So you guys know I've been doing Easter videos. I got these Easter Bunny ears from Michaels. And I'm not going to say all the prices in this because I don't know where all the receipts are and everything's just been mixed around so it would be way too difficult for me to remember exactly what I paid for everything. I got this colorful bag of Easter grass and look at that. You probably saw it in my Easter egg decorating video, the crayon melting one. And you probably also saw this cute little basket in my crayon Easter egg video as well. Also from Michaels I got these felt stickers. There's a bunny. There's another type of bunny. Then there's flowers and carrots. So these are really cute stickers. Also for Michaels, I got these perler bead pegboards. So there's two clear connectable pegboards in here. These are my favorite. Oh, was that glaring on your face? I'm sorry. <laughs> so you can see right there that they connect together and hopefully I'll be doing more perler bead videos. I mean, not very often, but I just want to have a bigger pegboard. So in case I want to make a big design, then I can. These three bags of Rainbow Loom rubber bands from Michaels. And also these two packs of wooden shapes. We have wooden beads and wooden hearts. A pack of mini googly eyes. And there's 410 of these guys inside. They just wiggle. Remember that? Wiggle. I got these two beautiful rolls of duct tape. Look at it. I like it a lot. I got three things from Staples. I got a crayon sharpener just because I've been doing a lot of crayon doodles. And yes, I'm still going to do a crayon doodle video, but there's a few more pictures I want to draw before I do it. So that's this. I could not find a crayon sharpener anywhere. So Staples, you're amazing. And I also got this pencil sharpener for colored pencils because literally every pencil sharpener I have been getting has been total crap when it comes to sharpening my colored pencils. So we're gonna hope this one works. Then I got some Crayola sidewalk chalk and it comes with all these pretty colors. There is a parking garage outside the apartment complex and the entire top of it is like a running track and you can do whatever you want up there. So I'm just gonna be really sly and sneaky one day and go up there and maybe like write with chalk and like put it in a video. So just maybe for an intro or something. I like chalk. From Walmart, I got some candy, and this is not for me to eat. It's actually for a craft, a couple different crafts. Did you guys know that they have pink lemonade dum-dums? Ah! I also got these mini chocolate chips and these pretzels. I got these two packs of crafty things from Walmart. So there's pom-poms, and then there's these fuzzy sticks, which I always thought they were called pipe cleaners, but whatever. And then I also got these two sheets of white craft foam. I got a little out of order, so these two bags of candy melts are also from Michaels. I got yellow and white. And then with my 40% off coupon, these are also for a project, I got these food coloring markers. And they're just going to be so cool because you can actually write on your desserts. Another thing from Walmart is this peacock duct tape. Also, I got this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful lamp. This is pretty much my favorite color in the world. It's like the light turquoise Tiffany's blue. And it came separately. I can't even... Oh my gosh, I'm going to break this. Okay, you have to buy the base and the shade separately so you can mix and match any way you want to. This was $12 and this was 9 And yeah, somehow I remembered the prices for those because I just looked it up and posted a picture on Instagram. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate this lampshade and... I can post a DIY video for you guys. It's not really going to be a full-blown tutorial because it's just how I want to decorate it. I'm probably going to glue some rhinestones and either use fabric paint or puffy paint or fabric markers to doodle black designs all over this shade. I don't know, I might add a bow to the bottom or something, but I definitely want to leave this the color that it is because it's beautiful. Going back to Target because I'm so scattered in this video, I got a game called Scategories, and there it is. 
I actually have this game at my mom's house, but I didn't have it here, so I got one for Craig and I to play. And this is my favorite game, and I'm going to beat him every single time, and I'm just really good. I'm not bragging or anything, but I really like this game, so I take pride in being pretty good at it. Also, I got this game called The Logo Board Game, which is pretty fun because I like pop culture. I played this game with my boyfriend over the weekend. We played three rounds. I won two of them. Um, yeah, I like to win. So anyway, it's a fun game and I really recommend it. Then I got this training baseball because I want to make a baseball stitch bracelet and I need to start practicing. So I got this colorful one. I went to this giant store called Garden Ridge and it's mainly home decor which is not good for me at this point because I live in a one bedroom apartment. I know I tell this story a lot but I literally have no room to store anything. It probably looks like a giant mess back in that corner because I have to actually start storing craft supplies like on the ground. They're in containers but I mean I have no room to store anything. I have stuff like stored under the bed and I'm not a hoarder I promise you guys but literally we have the living room and the bedroom to store things in and um, it's a furnished apartment so none of our stuff matches because when we moved in you know we already had like the dresser and the couch and everything basically what I'm trying to say is we can't buy a bunch of stuff from Garden Ridge because it's mostly home decor and outside decor and we don't have a yard I got some of this turquoise and purple and black leopard print duct tape I got this wooden letter S and I plan to decorate it either glittery or rhinestone -y or something of the sort and I got an S because my name is Sarah and my channel is so craftastic and S stands for sweet and spiffy and spectacular and I also got these dessert shooters because I thought it would be a fun future video to do something with these and there's only two of them in here but I can still do a video with them and I also got a bag of Snyder's cheddar pretzels which are delicious but they're in the pantry and I already started eating them so I don't need to pull that out here you guys just know that they were delicious <laughs> we have made it through all of the crafting items and crafty type things decorations there was even random stuff in there I know but I just want you guys to know that if you're only watching my channel because you love crafts and you hate fashion, you hate clothing and seeing anything like that, then you probably don't want to watch any more of this video unless you want to like skip ahead to the bloopers. If I have bloopers, I don't even know. I haven't been doing anything weird today. So, well, okay, I'm always weird. But basically this next half of the video is going to be all clothing and shoes and jewelry and accessories. So if you're not into that, just don't watch. Don't tell me, Sarah, don't put clothes on your craft channel because it's stupid because uh, I won't even respond to you because I'm telling you, I'm giving you a warning. A lot of you guys asked me to do a birthday haul and I really didn't have anything to show because most people got me cards and gift cards and money. My boyfriend got me some luggage and like we also went out to dinner and I got a Michael's gift card from him. But basically I didn't have any items to show. But I do have two that I can show you. I got this necklace from my friend Kim and she got it from J. Crew. It's pretty. And then my dad and little sisters picked me out this purse. It's one from JCPenney. Here's the back of it and here's the inside. I really like the studs and that it's neutral. I like brown purses. They're nice. I went to Banana Republic with my boyfriend and you might have seen this in my spring outfit of the day slash vlog video that I just recently posted on Sarah Lynn Fashion not too long ago. That's my fashion channel. A lot of you guys still don't know that I have a fashion beauty channel. So that's it. Check it out if you enjoy stuff like that. Actually, that's one of my boyfriend's favorite stores. I only have one shirt from there up until this stuff that I got. But it's really not my style usually and most of the stuff there is too big for me and I don't want to complain about that or anything but literally I have to shop at Junior's stores because I can't fit into women's clothes usually not very well. I came across the cardigans at Banana Republic and I just had to have this. I tried it on and it was love at first fitting. I love the colors, I love the feel of it and the thickness of it. Everything is just perfect. I got this plain white top it's kind of ribbed. I know you can't see the detail too well with this lighting, so I got this one as well. I got this pair of turquoise shoes from Rue 21, and I was actually going to use these in my doodle video, but I decided I wanted to keep them as is. I would probably have just like decorated them with black designs, 
but I really like these and I'm gonna keep them and wear them. I also got this gorgeous pair of shoes from Rue 21 and I really love these so these will definitely be in an upcoming spring fashion video on my fashion channel. From Victoria's Secret I got these bathing suit bottoms. I'm so excited to wear these with a black bikini top or if I had a gold one that would be sweet too but I don't yet. From PacSun I got these clothes. You probably saw me wear these in a picture and a video, but these are actually flowy shorts that resemble a skirt, so these are super cute. I love them. I got this plain white t-shirt, but it has crochet detailing on both sides at the bottom. These two tanks are the exact same style, but different patterns fabric, as you can see. They both have this ruffle thing going on at the top, and sometimes it's really good to buy two things that are the same style but in different colors if they work well for your body type and stuff, so that's why I got two of them. I also got this black crop top. It's very nice. I like to have plain tops to wear with my pattern skirts and shorts. I got this tank top, which is the coolest thing ever. It's a bunch of cats, and I cannot wait to wear this in a video. Oh my gosh, like look at the kitty cats. I got this flash dance crop top from Forever 21. I am in love with 80s movies, 80s music, 80s fashion. So this is perfect. Oh my gosh. I love, love, love it. Love it. Flash dance. I also got this giant neon beaded necklace. And look at that. Statement necklace. From Claire's, I got this bigger pair of stud earrings that I have in my first hole here. I also got this turquoise heart beaded bracelet and it has silver beads and I know I could make something like this myself but the problem is finding this charm in the first place. I also got this bow headband that I'm wearing. It kind of looks like a bandana and I like that about it and I got this one as well which is just black lacy material. From Hollister I got this blue and white striped bow back crop top. It has a bow in the back. I got this crop top from Charlotte Russe. It's navy blue. I really wish that they had this crop top in pretty much every single color because I would have snatched this up in every color. I'm not even kidding. It is so perfect to wear with high-waisted skirts. These are just normal shorts and they have really fun cutouts in them and you can see kind of like a lacy laciness through them. I got these from a local store here in Tulsa called Mustache, like must stash. So it's like mustache. But anyway, yeah, I thought that was a really clever name. And they also have little rips on the back, so these are awesome. Finally, this pair of clothes from Air Pistol, or Arrow, whatever you want to say. I got necklaces tangled. I got this rhinestone cross necklace. I got this multiple strand gold necklace with a little bit of pearlage going on and a little love charm. Oh, that was backwards. It says love. It does. Then I got this kind of spiky necklace here, which is awesome. I got a light wash denim jacket, and it has some rips in it, which is a really cool style. I got these two skirts. You can see that there's a gray leopard print pattern one, and then this blue floral, which is so pretty. I got these two shirts, which are the same style. I wore this one already in a video, but this one is a navy blue and kind of white diamond pattern. These fit really nicely, and they're soft. I got this striped tank which has these long sides and this is kind of different from what I would normally wear so I kind of am stepping out of the box a little with this style but I hope to make it work. I got this tank that has a motorcycle and it says infinite roads ahead. This one says Le Meow. Here's a love shirt and this is from the Bethany Moda line. I was going to get a few more of her shirts but literally... The smalls and extra smalls are completely picked over. I waited a little too long. I got this navy blue and it even has lace on it, but it's a crop top and it has this stretchy panel in the back. Then I got this floral crop top and it's a little bit like another top or two that I have. Finally, I have a pair of high rise shorts. They don't cover my belly button, but they are a nice light wash and I like them. That's everything. I hope you guys didn't find this haul to be too long and boring. I put a lot of stuff in here and like I said, I didn't want to make another haul for my fashion channel since I'm going to be wearing a lot of these outfits on there and I just don't want to put hauls all the time everywhere. So that's pretty much it. Check out, there are dust, dust particles in front of me. Check out my links in the down bar, especially to my Instagram. I love Instagramming. So my Instagram is Sarah Lynn T T E A. 
and that's my official SoCraftastic Instagram. So a lot of you might be confused by the SoCraftastic fan pages that people have made for me. Those are not me. Sarah Lynn T is me. And I guess I'll stop talking. So you guys have a great rest of the day, and I will see you soon. Bye. Ow! I just dropped duct tape on my knee. Peacock feathers. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm choking on air. Oh yeah, P.S. I got my hair colored.